Hi, it's Julie at Love's Beginning with a message called The Extension of Love That You Allow, The Extension of Love That You Are. Time and space can be experienced as the projection of fearful thought or the extension of loving thought. You know which you are experiencing by how you feel. If you notice that you are experiencing the projection of fearful thought, remember that you are never condemned or stuck. You need only to look at the thought of the moment and to come into the willingness to allow spirit to supply all your thinking. Every day is an opportunity, again and again, to remember that that the thoughts of ego are useless to you, while thoughts from spirit, freely given as you allow it, always lead you into happiness. There is a you that you can view from the perspective of close to the action and judging all the actions, fear. And there is a you that you can perceive when the camera is panned way, way back, where the perception of everything as joined now can come into view. Whenever you are disturbed, you are close to the action, believing that each element within what you are observing is separate and has its own power a power that can dominate you or others. You have an option here in this moment of noticing that you are close to the action and judging elements that look separate to you. You can remember that in actuality everything is and always has been joined and everything shares the same innocence that is yours. Everything, no matter how it appears on the surface to you, is the same conduit back to the remembrance of right now universal innocence and worth. Many moments spent each day in this willingness to remember universal innocence and worth means that you are willing to be conducted into a happiness that is not due to a pleasant arrangement of separate elements viewed in your world. It is a happiness that you are. If it is a happiness that you are, It is a happiness that all others are, with no exceptions. As you allow it, all of the seen as separate elements of your world become mirrors to reflect that happiness back to you, to happiness. When happiness looks in the mirror, it sees happiness. As you remember that all are and always have been this happiness, you see happy reflections. The darkest recesses of your mind are where you are attached to the close-up view of separate and opposing elements. You can feel this attachment as disquiet or tension of any kind. When you are looking at the world and believing there is a specific problem, it's actually always the same problem, your attachment to the perception of unreality. If it's always your problem, That means you are never subject to the problems of others, no matter how it looks. Remember this. When the ego is telling me how things are, it's never actually how it seems. I can always ask to see things as they truly are, behind the surfaces. Everything in your life is working together to help you see things differently. Where your attachment to unreality is exposed by a burst of not good feeling, give thanks. This is your opportunity to return to full awareness of your true power, a power that you always share fully and equally with all, a power that can never be abused or diminished. You have the opportunity right now to give your life over to this benign and loving power. You have many such opportunities and you will have them for as long as you need them. Any element of your life experience that seems to be bad, it's not actually what you think you're seeing and experiencing and interpreting. Are you willing to fall back instead of straining forward? Are you willing to fall back into the seat we provide as we zoom you way, way back and show you the same light that is shining behind every appearance no matter what its seeming quality? As you trust this light, you trust spirit to provide every thought you need, and spirit's thoughts cause all action and speech that flows through you. 
your effort is not needed except as it applies to intentionally turning back toward the light. Everything is provided for you, and you feel the joy of spirit playing you in harmony. This is simple, very simple, and we shine in joy as we bask in the simplicity of blessings eternally given and received. Thanks for listening.